Rachel Witter. Starting to feel a lot more comfortable out there thanks to the humidity finally getting out of the area. We had a cold front move through earlier today that brought us some heavy rain at times, but it will also make us feel a lot more comfortable over the next 24 hours. Here's a live look in Old Forge tonight from our INET camera network. Still some clouds hanging on in the north country, but for the most part, we're starting to lose the cloud cover and temperatures still in the 70s. We've got 75 degrees in Utica, partly cloudy skies. Winds are out of the west northwest at 16 miles per hour, so it is a little bit breezy out there, and we still have some lingering humidity, but that's going to keep going down as we head into the overnight hours. 77 degrees in Dulgeville right now, 75 in Cooperstown, same story in Hamilton for your Tuesday evening. And again, we're starting to lose all of that rain shower activity. We're still looking at a chance of a few isolated showers and storms to the north. Those should mainly stay isolated to the north country, but otherwise, we're starting to clear out very nicely over the last few hours, and that will set ourselves up for a very pleasant Wednesday. It looks like we'll see some sunshine. The uh, humidity will be out of the area, and temperature is very comfortable as well. So here's our cold front. That's moving well off to the east for tonight, and just to our west, really not a whole lot going on. We will be watching for some thunderstorm chances as we head into your Thursday and Friday. But tomorrow, probably going to be the pick of the week. We've got lower humidity. It's going to feel a lot more comfortable. And we're going to keep the rain at bay for at least the next 24 hours before more thunderstorm chances work in for your Thursday and Friday. And unfortunately, for the weekend as well. But for tonight, again, we'll start to lose that cloud cover. And that will actually lead to a cool start to your Wednesday. We're looking at temperatures in the 50s for tomorrow morning, but lots of sunshine on tap through much of the day. Really just some passing clouds, otherwise very pleasant middle of the work week. And as we head into your Wednesday evening, cloud cover thickens up a little bit, but we're still looking at some relatively cool temperatures. And then as we head into Thursday, a little bit more cloud cover, and that will be followed with the chance of a few isolated rain showers by the afternoon, more so for your Friday. But for tonight, 53 degrees, a lot cooler than what we've been used to and very comfortable without that humidity factor. And for tomorrow, lots of sunshine on tap, 78 degrees, part cloudy southeast winds three to eight miles per hour but again we're looking at the chance of some thunderstorms for your Thursday those are gonna be late in the day and even lingering into early Friday morning but Friday all also looking pretty pleasant 73 degrees partly cloudy skies rain chances work in by the end of the day on Saturday and then lingering into your Sunday we're upping the temperatures we're upping mm -hmm. the humidity for the end of the work week but it doesn't look like a total washout for both weekend days tomorrow and yeah. Friday is when to get outside yes right? exactly sunshine will be very nice to see over the past few days we haven't seen a whole lot of that yeah. so it'll be nice tomorrow definitely not but mugginess does kind of come with the territory in late very June. true right thanks mm -hmm. a lot Rachel still ahead tonight